की पहली किरण से आशा कसवेरा जागे Solar Energy Corporation of India or SEGI was set up in September 2011 under the Ministry of New and Renewable Energy MNRE to implement and promote solar energy under Jawaharlal Nehru National Solar Mission हमारे यहां जो कल्पना जगत है उस कल्पना जगत में कहते हैं ऊर्जा में उन्होंने सूर्य भगवान की कल्पना की है और सूर्य सात घोड़ों का रथ होता है सूर्य भगवान का ऊर्जा की कल्पना ही की सूर्य ऊर्जा का तो केंद्र है ही है उसका तो कोई इनकार नहीं कर सकता है आज के युग में मैं देख रहा हूं वो सात घोड़े कौन से होने चाहिए हमारे जो ये सूर्य का घोड़ा है ऊर्जा का घोड़ा है वो कौन से सात घोड़े उसको चलाए अब तक हमको आदत है थर्मल की एक घोड़ा दूसरी है गैस की तीसरी हाइड्रो की चौथी है न्यूक्लियर करके इसके आसपास तो थोड़ा बहुत हम चल रहे हैं लेकिन हम तीन और घोड़े भी लगाने की जरूरत है सोलार विंड एंड बायोमास एज इन विजन बाय द ऑनरेबल प्राइम मिनिस्टर सोलर एनर्जी कॉर्पोरेशन ऑफ इंडिया इज नाउ ट्रांसेंडिंग इन टू रिन्यूएबल एनर्जी कॉर्पोरेशन ऑफ इंडिया टू हार्नेस अदर फॉर्म्स ऑफ रिन्यूएबल एनर्जी सच एज विंड biomass small hydro among others renewable energy is the new frontier and continuous search for wider applications is the need of the day newer experiments are being carried out throughout the world for finding out innovative solutions with improved efficiencies enhanced durability and better cost competitiveness Government of India has assigned SEKE the task to develop solar power in the country through VGF viability gap funding support About 650 megawatt solar projects have already started generation in the states of Gujarat Rajasthan Madhya Pradesh Maharashtra Karnataka and Kerala Over 7000 megawatt capacity of solar power is in the pipeline in the next 5 years. The solar power is being supplied to Delhi, Odisha, Haryana, Assam and others. The company is emerging as one of its kind ventures engaged in large scale interstate trading of solar power. It has crossed important milestone of achieving 100 million units of trading on 30th June 2015. It is expected to cross 1000 million units by March 2016. To accelerate the process of achieving its mission, the company has developed association with various stakeholders such as Solar Power Developers, Central Transmission Utility, Central and State Regulators, State Transmission Utilities and Regional and State Load Dispatch Centers. Besides developing solar power through government schemes the company has envisioned to set up 1000 megawatt of solar power on its own by 2020 Company is also partnering with various CPSUs to develop large capacity solar power projects in the country through PMC or project management consultancy In order to develop niche areas of applications, Seki is implementing a couple of innovative solar projects at Indo-Pak borders and cold desert areas of Lahore, Spiti, Leh and Kargil. The initial target of 20,000 megawatts solar power by the year 2022 has been revised fivefold to 100,000 megawatt. The company has been working relentlessly towards this mission by developing large-scale solar projects, both ground-mounted and solar rooftops, and other solar applications to promote and commercialize the use of solar energy in order to reach the remotest corner of India. Seki has been implementing flagship solar rooftop scheme of MNRE as a nodal agency. The company has brought in the concept of bidding in this segment which resulted in price reduction. Seki facilitated the first Resco rooftop project of 500 kilowatt peak capacity for Delhi Metro Rail Corporation DMRC 
which has triggered development of such projects by DMRC and other metros. The company has also showcased a 130 kilowatt peak system on ISBT, a classical example of how public transport utility can strive towards green energy. Seiki is working with large number of government companies including CPWD to design and develop solar rooftop buildings. Schools and colleges function mostly during the daytime when sun is in its most productive phase. During weekends and school holidays, the solar plant can continue to run and feed power to the grid under the net metering scheme. Be it the government buildings or religious institutions, all are joining this solar power revolution. Special focus is given to rooftop solar installations on hospitals and public health centers. Warehouses in the country owned by public and private have large potential for rooftop installations and are being specifically targeted. The warehouse owner will earn rent per unit of energy and surplus power will be fed to DISCOM for meeting their renewable power obligations. Pristine islands of Andaman and Nicobar is home to world-renowned virgin beaches. These islands fully depend on diesel-generated power for its needs. Solar power, the green energy, will help in substituting the diesel and long-term sustainability. The challenges of energy access to rural population is being addressed by using solar power. 1,35,000 LED solar lanterns are being distributed in the backward and cyclone-affected districts of Andhra Pradesh, Odisha, Telangana, Uttarakhand, Bihar, Jharkhand, Uttar Pradesh, West Bengal and Northeastern states through the CSR support of Rural Electrification Corporation REC. Around 10,000 solar lanterns were supplied to the flood affected areas of Jammu and Kashmir and another 5,000 lanterns to the earthquake affected neighboring country of Nepal. Lithium-ion based solar street lights have been specially got designed and installed in the tribal and backward districts of Jharkhand through CSR support from PFC. The company has installed a 30 kW peak solar PV system with water heating system for old age home for widows in the city of Vrindavan through CSR support from Ireda. Sabka Saath, Sabka Vikas, an inclusive growth in the true sense. The company is working towards Make in India objective by promoting solar systems manufacturing within the country. The next big ticket venture is to establish large solar parks across the country with aggregate capacity of 20,000 megawatt. The parks will have all important infrastructures such as roads, internal connectivity with plug and play system and evacuation of power through extra high voltage transmission system. Green energy corridors being developed by Power Grid and other state transmission utilities with the financial support of multilateral agencies like KFW, ADB and World Bank to carry renewable energy such as solar and wind from source of generation to load centers across the states. The company has achieved a profitability in its third year of its inception and registered a pat of Rs 10.6 crores for financial year 2014-15. Seki has been an MOU signing PSU since financial year 2014-15. The company has a dedicated and motivated team of trained intellectual manpower in order to deliver its technical, administrative and financial pursuits. Renewable energy is the energy of tomorrow and we are marching towards a brighter, greener and sustainable tomorrow.